A home now, a Missouri man lost his son during the Hamas attacks just last month. In a story you'll see only on Five on Your Side, a group of Jewish fraternity brothers from Mizzou are making sure he doesn't grieve alone. Annie Kroll joins us now with her exclusive report. Annie. Well, exactly, Brent. Three A.E. Pie brothers from Mizzou are home for Thanksgiving break. I asked them why would they want to be part of a funeral ritual for a man they'd never met. Like here in America, it's kind of hard to help out in some ways. So any way that we could figure it out, how to help, is we were willing to do it. Driving more than three hours south of Columbia, almost 20 A. Pi brothers from Mizzou made the trip to Branson on October 9th. Their Jewish fraternity president learned about Ariel Presso, who had just lost his son in the October 7th Hamas attacks while attending a music festival in the desert. More sadness than I had ever felt because I can't imagine what this guy is going through. And not only that, he's all alone in Branson where there's not a huge Jewish community. In the Jewish faith, sitting Shiva means eating and telling stories about those who passed. But a few things were missing for the prayer circle called a minion. To have a minion, which is a group of 10 people in Judaism who say prayer. It's not just when somebody dies. Usually Jewish prayers are said in a group of 10, making it a minion. And he didn't have 10 people to be part of the minion with him. All three of the AEPI brothers are Parkway Central High School graduates. Ryan and Brian have known each other since preschool. They say this chapter of their college years is one of the most meaningful. It's, it's hard enough losing someone, let alone your son, in a horrible act like what just happened. And then to be alone, you know, putting yourself in, in those shoes, it really, it really is upsetting, so you'd want, we wanted to really just get down there and make sure that he knew that he had a community surrounding him. And the Chesterfield native said if you're interested in helping Israel, consider donating to an organization like the Jewish Federation of St. Louis or the Jewish National Fund.